Hello friends, very good morning to all of you and uh, here is the motivational quote for today. It is never too late to be what you might have been. What does it signify? This means that अगर अपने कुछ करने का मन किया है वो करना ही है आपको हो सकता है कि कुछ टाइम लग गया कुछ मतलब बहुत ही टाइम लग गया आपके पास अपॉर्चुनिटी है तो उसको छोड़ो मत जो आपका एम है लाइफ में गोल है उस पर लगे रहो वो डेफिनेटली एक ना एक दिन सक्सेसफुल के रूप में आपके पास आएगा सक्सेस के रूप में आपके पास आएगा राइट एंड दिस कोट हैज बीन गिवन बाय द फेमस पर्सनालिटी दैट इज जॉर्ज एलियट it is never too late to be what you might have been what you are aspiring for what you are going to uh, take as a success note in your life definitely it will come to your feet soon maybe it's a little bit uh, longer time it may take but if you stick to this particular this would definitely touch your feet so that's the meaning of this particular right so with this uh, note we are going to start the today's current affairs and uh, here's the first question for you government targets to raise india's in power capacity to 22480 megawatt from 6780 megawatt this is a massive increase and this would be taken care by which year and the year that is that is 20 31 option b the indian government has set a target of increasing the country's nuclear power capacity from the current 6780 megawatt to 22480 megawatt by 2031 right so remember the year that is 2031 government targets to raise the india's in power capacity to what amount that is 22480 from where this may not be remembered but uh, the capacity to be increased to what amount that is 22480 megawatt right by 2031 moving to question number 2 here which iit develops plant based plastic packaging material alternate for single use plastics which iit develops plant based plastic packaging material that is alternate for single use plastics and the answer here is iit roorkee option a Researchers at the Department of Paper Technology, Indian Institute of Technology, IIT Roorkee, have developed a substitute single-use plastics packaging manufactured by 60% plant-based polysaccharides without using chemicals. Right? So IIT Roorkee develops plant-based plastic packaging material, right? And this is for alternate single-use plastics. And the uh, institute name that is IIT Roorkee. Moving to question number three here. Which of the following IIT post chair of Jal Jeevan Mission for Water Treatment Technology, and that is IIT Guwahati. Indian Institute of Technology Guwahati has established a chair of Jal Jeevan Mission for Water Treatment Technology aimed at enabling every rural household to have a functional household tap connection by 2024. And it's talking about the which IIT? That is IIT Guwahati. Jal Jeevan Mission for Water Treatment Technology. Just take this bullet note here. That is Jal Jeevan Mission for Water Treatment Technology. That is IIT Guwahati, and uh, uh, and and uh, this technology aimed at enabling every household to have a functional and household tap connection. That is 2024, right? The year uh, is already mentioned here. That is by 2024, IIT Guwahati will host a chair of Jal Jeevan Mission Water Treatment Technology. This uh, this is the aim. Uh, that by 2024 to have every household have a functional household tap connection by 2024 right and uh, here mihir kumar purkait from the department of chemical engineering at the institute of has been selected for the first occupant of this chair that is iit guwahati so who is the personality mihir kumar purkait right. who has been appointed as the interim ceo of catholic syrian bank that is csb catholic syrian bank csb bank appointed its current deputy managing director prolay mondol as the interim managing director and ceo for a period of 3 months from 2022 to 1st april 
till the appointment of the regular MD and CEO, whichever is earlier. So, Prolai Mondal recently been appointed as the Chief Executive Officer of CSB. This is the interim appointment. It may be get confirmed or maybe uh, some other persons uh, come in this particular field, right? See, we are Rajendran, the present MD and CEO will take early retirement from the position due to health reasons and further continued office of the Managing Director and CEO till the close of the hour, 31st March 2022. And the Catholic Syrian Bank headquarters is in Trishul, Kerala. Right? And uh, presently, Interim Managing Director and CEO, that is Prolai Mondo. Remember the name here, right? This is not uh, yet confirmed, but yes, it may get confirmed. If it's get confirmed, I will definitely take up that particular news. But yes, this time, this is the interim managing director and CEO. The name is Prolai Mondal of Catholic Syrian Bank. This is done by RBI. Question number five here. Kamakoti Vesinathan, Kamakoti Vesinathan has been appointed as a director of which IIT? Kamakoti Vesinathan. That is the name here. Uh, quite a tough name, but yes. Kamakoti Vesinathan has been appointed as the director of which of the following IIT? That is IIT Madras. IIT Madras newly appointed director Kamakoti Vesinathan envisions that his tenure will see the institute jointly filling patents with Indian farmers. Right? IIT Madras is working with the Tamil Nadu government set up the rural interaction centers as well. So, who has been appointed as the director of IIT? Which IIT? That is IIT Madras. And Kamakoti Vesinathan has been appointed as the director of the uh, state IIT, that is IIT Madras. Moving to question number six here. Who, who has been appointed as the director of CPG, Auto and D2C Industry Vertical of Meta? Meta recently changed its name from Facebook in India. So who has been appointed as the director of the same, that is Meta? That is, what's the name? That is Sogato Vomi. Sogato Vomi, Bengali person here. So, Meta has announced the appointment of Sorvata Vomik as the director of CPG, Auto and D2C Industry Vertical in India. As per the company, the appointment is in line with the expanding charter and the commitment to India and follows a series of senior leadership requirements over the past month across business, policy and partnership. So, Meta, that is Facebook earlier name, changes and its name to Meta and headquarters. Menlo Park is in California. Menlo Park is in California as a headquarter and head that is Mark Zuckerberg. Right? So, who has been appointed as the director of CPG Auto D2C Industry Vertical of Meta that is in India? The name of the personality that is Sogata Homi. Moving to question number seven here. Next one. Famous personality Omshak Chatterjee passed over recently in which field he belongs to. And uh, this is uh, uh, quite a sad news here. Bengali actor, right? Option B. Avishak Chatterjee on Thursday passed away at the age of only 57, right? Very shocking news to us. Chatterjee made his debut with the Bengali film Poth Bola, that is in 1986, that is the first film directed by Tarun Mojumdar. He was seen alongside the veterans such as Utpal Dutt, Koshinji Chatterjee, Sandha Rai, Tapush Pal. His other films include the Shuret Akashe, Ora Charjon. Orjun Aman Nam, Tumi Koto Shundar, Tufan, Mariada, Amor Prem, Papi, Sabustati, Aranet Nath Jamai, Mayer Achal, among others. Mayer Achal, among others. The veteran actor has also worked in television. So, these are the, some of the very prominent films done by this personality, the famous personality, Bengali actor, Avishak Chatterjee. And uh, his debut film, the Bengali film, that is Pothola in 1986. Right? Very sad news here. Uh, very shocking. Only 57. It uh, uh, can't be imagined that this kind of uh, incident can happen. This is absolutely shocking to all of us. Okay. So the question here is, famous personality Avishak Chatterjee passed away recently. In which field he belongs to? He is a Bengali actor. Moving to question number eight here. Which IIT researchers produce new photocatalysts that convert plastic to hydrogen and other useful products? And that is IIT Mandi. Option A. Indian Institute of Technology Mandi researchers have developed a method that can transform the plastic into hydrogen with the exposed to light. 
The generation of hydrogen from plastics is particularly useful because gas is considered and the most practical non-polluting fuel of the future, right? So, IIT Mandi researchers produced a new photocatalyst that convert the plastics into hydrogen and other useful products. But remember, this plastic to hydrogen products can be converted, and this uh, photocatalyst, uh, this uh, IIT Mandi researchers produced a new photocatalyst. The, this is the kind of photocatalyst process that can convert the plastic into hydrogen, and this can be uh, this is done by which IIT? That is IIT Mandi researchers, right? Okay, moving to next. Who has been appointed as the MD and Chief Executive Officer of Maruti Suzuki? The name is a little bit difficult. Just remember it here. That is option B. Hisashi Tekiuchi. Hisashi Tekiuchi has been named as the MD and CEO of Maruti Suzuki. Right? I hope this is clear. Maruti Suzuki has been appointed as the MD and CEO of the same company, of the same company, that is Hisashi Tekiuchi. And that is only written here. Appointed Hisashi Tekuchi as the managing director and chief executive officer. It, it will be effective from 1st April 2022. Right? And the earlier uh, uh, MDR CEO, that is Kenichi Ayukawa, his personality would be completed on 31st of March 2022. Right? Moving to next year. Which state signs an MAO with NIPER Mohali for upcoming medical devices park in Nalagar? Okay, so what's the full form here for NIPER? That is National Institute of Pharmaceutical Education and Research. National Institute of Pharmaceutical Education and Research. National Institute of Pharmaceutical Education and Research. So which state science and MO with the National Institute of Pharmaceutical Education and Research? Mohali, the uh, respective office in Mohali for upcoming medical devices park in Nalagar. And that is in Himachal Pradesh, option D. Chief Minister Jairam Thakur said on Thursday that the state government has signed a memorandum of understanding with the National Institute of Pharmaceutical Education and Research, Mohali, as a knowledge partner for the upcoming medical devices park in Nalagar. And Himachal Pradesh, some static fact that is, Simla is the capital, uh, CM is the uh, CM is Jairam Thakur and governor that is Rajendra Arlekar. Right? So, Himachal Pradesh, some static fact. Simla is the capital, Jayam Thakur is the CM, and Rajendra Alekar is the place of governor, 21st governor of Himachal Pradesh, right? Remember this, 21st governor of Himachal Pradesh, and, uh, okay, 21st governor of Himachal Pradesh, that is Rajendra Alekar. Moving to next year, which IIT scientist is going to help school kids learn about vaccines, virus in its seven SciTech sci spin lecture? Which IIT? Scientist is going to help school kids learn about vaccines, virus in its seventh SciTech Spins lecture, and that is IIT Delhi. Option C. Indian Institute of Technology, IIT Delhi, is soon going to host the seventh SciTech Spins lecture. During the lecture, IIT Delhi's Kushuma School of Biological Science professor, that is Mandipa Banerjee, will deliver the lecture titled "The Virus, uh, Virus versus Host." Welfare at nanoscale for the school kids on 26th of March. And the school, uh, the, the, the lecture will also be live streamed on the IIT Delhi's official YouTube channel. Okay, so uh, IIT Delhi scientist is going to help school kids to learn about the vaccines virus in a seven SciTech spin lecture, right? So the Answer is IIT Delhi here to learn the school students about the vaccines virus in its seventh site explain lecture. This is IIT Delhi. Moving to next year, who has been appointed as the chief operating officer of my classroom? Easy one, my classroom, chief operating officer, and what's the name? That is Mohit Goel. Mohit Goel has been appointed as chief operating officer of my classroom. Easy to remember, Mohit Goel, my classroom. M and M. M. So, Mohit Goel, my classroom. EdTech platform, my classroom, has announced the appointment of Mohit Goel as the chief operating officer. In his new role, Goel will be responsible to lead the growth strategy of the company and scale up the organization while closely working with the academics, operations, scale market, sales, marketing, customer experience team. Right? So, Mohit Goel has been appointed as the chief operating officer of my classroom. So, we have discussed 12 questions along with the options. Now, I hope the one-liners there. Yes. So these are the one-liners here on your screen. So the first one, first bullet, 
It is paid customers to get green points from April 2022. Right? Railway paid customers to get green points from April 2022. Colliers appoints Kanchana Krishnan as MD of Chennai. Uh, Colliers, the managing director of Colliers, the particular office is in Chennai. That's talking about the MD of Colliers, which is in Chennai. The, head, uh, the MD becomes Kanchana Krishna. The name of this personality, Kanchana Krishna. Next, CETL and SUO. CETL and SUO to develop electric vehicle power trails. South Korea based researchers, South Korea based researchers developed smart LED connect lenses for treating diabetic retinopathy. South Korea based researchers develop smart LED contact lens for treating diabetic retinopathy. Next, Sona Comster launches Motor T family of motors. So, Motor T family launches by which of the following organization or institution that is Sona Comster. Sona Comster launches Motor T. Just remember this. Alembic Pharmaceuticals receives US FDA approval for Lacosamide tablets. Lacosamide tablets approval received by US FDA and that is Alembic Pharmaceutical. The name of this uh, company that's Alembic Pharmaceutical receives approval from US FDA for lacomacide tablets. Next, MG model launches MG eBay online auto finance platform. Piaggio, Piaggio Group said to open new production facility in Jakarta, Indonesia. And Rupaya is the Rupaya is the currency here. Nepal India PMs, the both countries PM, likely to join in inaugurate cross border railway link. Cross border railway link recently uh, signed by which of the two countries between India and Nepal. Right? So, India and Nepal PM likely to join, likely to jointly inaugurate cross border railway link. Right? So, yes, four. So, nine bullets are there. We have discussed as a form of one liners. So I hope you understood all the current affairs question along with these one-liners. And that is all for now. Thanks for watching.